A welcome to one of the noisier grounds in English football. It's not the biggest, but the supporters are so passionate. Selhurst Park, the home of Crystal Palace Football Club. And Alan Smith and I, Martin Tyler, will be trying to keep our voices above the din so that you can hear our commentary. Here's the Crystal Palace team. Jane Tompkins plays alongside Mamadou Sacco in the heart of the defence. Wilfred Zaha starts with Andros Townsend as the wide options. And it's good to see that they've got two strikers looking to provide the goal threat for them. James McArthur. Number 11, Wilfred Zaha. Number 14, Jordan Ayew. And number 23, Nitsu Pachishua. Here is the way Wolves are set out for this vital fixture. One thing to look out for from this team today is the way they try and win the ball back within seconds of losing it. Yeah, and they don't do it individually. They get backed up by a teammate. They hunt in packs, and you've got to do that. You've got to do it with discipline. Wolverhampton Wanderers. Thank you, Selhurst. They need a better showing and certainly a better result than their last game, that home reverse against Southampton. Yeah, 3-0, and uh, they were comfortable losers in the end, but uh, I do think they can bounce back, get a draw here. Batshuayi. Milivojevic. Zaha. Jean Moutinho. Andros Townsend. And now the shot! And that's deflected behind, it will be a corner. It's short the corner this time. That's right. Got the ball now under control and a chance to move themselves forward. Get up the pitch. It's given away. A great chance to go in front. And that will be a corner. The referee has given a corner here. Swung in from the corner. Well, it's come to nothing in the end. He's trying to catch the player in possession clearly no flash in the pan for Leicester City the fairy story of the 15-16 season the most unlikely champions an incredible tale and they're at it again well they could not have asked for a better start could they who could have predicted this side being in a Champions League spot but yes there's an awfully long way to go Martin we all know that and they certainly do too Zaha Well, there are players here who... Not a nice challenge. What will the ref do? It's a yellow card and... Well, it was a certain yellow card, wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. Looking back on it, he had no choice at all. Was that just a case of mistiming the tackle? Yeah, it was a, a forwards tackle in many ways. A poor one. Well, now they've got the ball, what are they going to do with it? He made that look like a poor pass with a very good interception. Could be a chance here. They've got the ball into a good area. He's got support here. A lot of defenders between them and they've got... And here's the shot. It's a corner. And here comes the corner. Not really away from the threat here. Fabian Delft. Fabian Dell, Andros Townsend. Great place to win it back. And shoots! A real miscue here. Trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went uh, straight to an opponent. Match way! Whipped in from the wide area. The goalkeeper has an easy task, Rui Patricio. Well, the wide man can show his skills here. This for the chance to go into the lead now. Bounce back off the post. Sacco. James MacArthur. James Tompkins. Joel Ward. It's Ward. How unlucky were they just then? I do think if they keep knocking on the door, they'll find a way through. 
Well, that is a cheap piece of play to give the ball away like that. It's one back. Trying to get it wide, and it was a good idea, but he couldn't find his supporting player. This is the kind of uh, pitch that I think attacking players favour, Alan, don't they? I think they do, yeah, because uh, it means mistakes from defenders. And uh, you know, a little bit of miscontrol, loss of footing, and uh, you're in. Now, this is an interesting attack. Then Donker, the pass threaded through. The real opening for him. Oh, it's the post! A penalty! Well, well, well. Here's a chance for the lead because he's given a penalty. Well, what a silly challenge, and that might just tip this match in the favour of the team that's won it. Could be dangerous in a wide position. Got the opposition backpedaling a little bit. Melibojevic. The goalkeeper has an easy task, Rui Patricio. And there is the half-time whistle. Nil-nil at the break. Well, the word average comes to mind about his first half. And this is the start of the second half. And it's Williams. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. In really for what seemed a certain opening goal. Oh dear, oh dear, I think it's one of those that might play on his mind now for the rest of the match. Batshuayi. to go in front good work by the goalkeeper Jordan Ayew probing away trying to find room for a shot maybe the shot's on that's so straightforward enough for the goalkeeper good hands but it would have been a surprise if he dropped it yeah kept his eye on the ball good handling from him After this, the visiting team are involved in this fixture in the Premier League, and you can join us on EA Sports for that match. Turnover there that we didn't expect. Fabian Dell. Milivojevic. Michi Bacuai. Definitely a throw in there. Just looking at the tactics of this match, maybe the substitution will hold the kick. Now it goes, oh, he's through. Time here to strike at goal. Oh. 
Saw it coming, cut it out, good work. And he could get away here. Out in front of goal. Well, the goalkeeper now at least can uh, relax a little bit. Uh, he was certainly tested to the full extent of his reflexes just a moment or two earlier. Yeah, I mean, the second save, a lot simpler than the first, that's for certain, but great goalkeeping. Blocked off the pass there. Zaha with Michi Batshuayi. Zaha, keeper goes with a fist here. They can be quick on the break now. Crystal Palace are going to make an alteration. There's a substitute coming on. Poor on the ball. Sheku Kuyate. Jordan Ayu. Here's a chance to attack. Jamutinho. Put them in front. The goal at last. The first goal of the game. And we've waited well over an hour to get it. But it's the team that have looked the most likely that have done it. And maybe they will use this as a platform to go on to win now. But they will expect the opposition to come back at them. They'll have to. And this is going to be a change here for the team that is leading and it's clearly a tactical one to try and cement that winning position Wolverhampton Wanderers have this lead and we have nine remaining minutes on the move and able to cut out the pass ball in behind by João Moutinho opportunity now and he's done it they're in, they've scored they're surely home and dry Two for him on the day, and two very well taken goals. And it's going to be a substitution now for this team. Restarting at 2-0. Time nearly up here, and just throw it forward a bit to their next game. Well, Crystal Palace go up against Everton after this and uh, really don't think they'll be happy at all. The manager, in fact, I think he's furious with them. 88 minutes played here. Plenty of width for the team to attack into. Good defensive clearance the there. Has indicated there will be a the has decided to add on two minutes. Milivojevic. That's it, the match is...
An international that I'm afraid on paper looks very one-sided and Alan Smith it might turn out that way on the pitch. Yeah, but as we know football not playing on paper and we have seen shocks in the past um, as a neutral you don't want it to be too one-sided but it has that look about it doesn't it? We'll wait and see. Today Uruguay against New Zealand. It's an international fixture here Alan that'll bring back memories for you and your England career. Well, it is a proud moment. You stand there, you sing along to the national anthem, and uh, you just want to do yourself justice by presenting your country. This is Uruguay's lineup. Fernando Muslera starts in goal. Diego Godin starts alongside Jose Maria Jimenez. In the heart of defense, Edinson Cavani is the main striker today. So the first half about to begin. Going forward well. Could get the ball into the box now. Good block, but a poor cross. It's a difficult technique, and he didn't quite catch it. Yeah, fair play for taking it on. Takes a bit of confidence to do that. Vecino. Trying to get the ball in behind. Can whip it in now. Well, they kept up the pressure, didn't they? But it's finally been out. Edison Cavani really shot on the 2010 World Cup when, of course, Uruguay had such a wonderful competition in South Africa. And he's uh, continued in European football with a lot of success. Yeah, he's sometimes disappointed, sometimes had a bit of stick. But. Uh... No doubt in his qualities when he's on song. Boy, beyond everyone, it's a throw. Throw in here. Oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out. Could whip it in from here. Darting infield now. Defended well. That pass never looked like reaching its target, and they're away with the ball. Now, here's a chance to get at the opposition. The shot's on! Kavar comes for the goal again to add another to his long list of strikes for this team. if you keep going in to that sort of area the ball will drop for you and it dropped perfectly for him I think that's a lesson to anybody uh, in due in a goal drought keep getting into the positions in the 18 yard in the six yard box and you will score he's not the easiest of managers to work for I know that but these players are doing what he demanded beforehand now So the first goal, it's 1-0. Bit predictable with the passing and the opposition able to deal with that. To Thomas. Singh, played forward, a bit of menace in this. Looking for an opening with some good control builder. Good defensive clearance there. Real gusto a moment or two ago. Steered through. Cavani. He might be through. 
Cavani! Just seemed to be a bit too tense at the final moment, and it could have been an important moment for them. Well, I just thought it was careless, actually. Made the challenge well. Certainly wanting to find a teammate, but he's just found an opponent. Shot off! Shot blocked here. Well, they've got a corner out of that. A bit lucky, it was deflected. Oh, the crowd delighted with this. Maybe uh, this set... Fox all! No difficulty at all for Fernando Muslera. It's one back. He's got his shot off now. Muslera with the save. Well, the focus very much. Threads it through. Cavani. The break is definitely on. Cavani! Good stretch by the goalkeeper to push that away from danger. Corner. And in it goes. Jimenez! It's a brave effort, really, in amongst the players to get the header in, but off target, way off target. Yeah, not his best effort, that's for sure. To Thomas, Michael Boxall, Rufa, Singh, Boyd, Tight scenario here on the ball. Diego Godin. Guided through. Real chance. An incisive pass. And such quality in the build up and a brilliant finish. A wonderful goal. It's no goal. The flag's up. But it's certainly a, a well worked move, but uh, denied by the assistant. What did you make of it, Alan? Well, I thought he was onside, you know, but uh, he's gone through and tucked it away. But looking at the replay, yes, he had gone a bit early. Sing. And that is quite a wild effort at goal, although he got good contact on the ball. These two countries going at hammer and tongs, despite it being billed as a friendly fixture. And just the one goal margin in it at the break, Alan. Yeah, uh, there's been a good edge to it, uh, really. But it, all to play for. Um, wouldn't be surprised to see a comeback in that second half. So the first half about to begin. Could get the ball into the box now. Good block, but a poor cross. It's a difficult... And here we go with the start of the second half. a bit too hard trying to force the pass and it went to straight to an opponent Rufa shots on here no difficulty at all for Fernando Muslera excellent interception we could be in in with a chance. Referee points for a corner.
put the corner in the middle. Well, it's come to nothing in the end. Vecino. Latch out. Oh, he's through. Latch out! Two in front now. Well, keep the concentration, and they've won this match, I think. He took the chance with absolute precision, Alan. Wasn't an easy one either, that Martin, but he made it look so. Well, they want to see this again, this goal. Restarting at 2-0. To Thomas. Here's Reed. Building steadily here, keeping possession. He's trying to catch the player in possession. The marking's really poor. He's got a chance. Looking for teammates in the middle. for it very sharp reaction save from close in well they've created chance after chance they need some ruthlessness now corner swung in the shot's up oh charge down well, no scraps for the attackers to feed on from the goalkeeper that time. Hung on to the ball well. Vecino. It's rare in a match of this quality that one man can stand out so much, but this is the fella doing it. It's the real authority down there in the way that he's uh, manipulating that ball and, and starting moves. This might be dangerous from the corner. In goes the corner. Cavani! Cavani comes up with the goal again to add another to his long list of strikes for this team. What a strike that was. I know they work hard on these set pieces and that corner was perfect. Well, here's the goal again. Well, I know this manager's been working hard on the training ground on a certain shape and boy, is it getting results out there. I don't think we expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. We've given it straight to the opposition. Cavani in a wide position now. And shoots! Full finish. Hat-trick. Goal number three here. And it's a perfect day for the player. They will be signing the match ball for him afterwards because of a hat-trick. Yeah, he won't forget this day in a hurry. Top stuff from him. Well, it's great when a plan comes together and the manager doubly delighted with the way his team are playing. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Nothing so far in this game to us, perhaps only the, the margin that they lead by. Yeah, it's not always easy coming into a game and everyone's expecting you to get a hat full, but they've 
kept their focus this side and uh, taken the chance, threading it through. Bit of space for him now out on the wing. Defended well. Not too much time for extra touches here. And we have nine remaining minutes. Attacking well here. Now that's a throw. Well, he's got options on the bench, of course. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Oh, chance! That is a fantastic goal. Well, good finish, no doubt, Martin, but what about the play before that? What about the passing? Wonderful team effort. Well, scoring in any game is worthy of celebration. When you get two, it is special. And he is feeling that special delight at the moment. It's time for some fresh legs here. It is now an extraordinary lead. And you could say, really, game over. Boy. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Cleared away by the defender. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Getting a clever ball. Cavani. It's a quick break. Wonderful interception. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there, and pass goes straight to the opposition. And here's the shot. Well, he would have dreamt about this last night, wouldn't he? To win his first game would have been enough, I think, to win it by... Uh, 